in honor of the full moon in Aries, let's do a card pull with the Moonology deck. Shall we? I always say that. Shall we? Okay, let me just shuffle the deck. In the meanwhile, or meanwhile, not in the meanwhile. Meanwhile, how are you? Really? That's great. Okay, come on, card. I don't have to speed this part up because this is just ridiculous. <laughs> it's just, it's not coming out. I don't know what's going on tonight. It's happened all night with me. The cards are just taking their sweet time. Okay, I'm gonna clear my energy. This full moon in Aries is major. My moon is in Aries. So I feel this big time. doing wrong ah oh, and my earbuds coming out there might be a cut in this video because I, I don't know if you're gonna want to watch me shuffle these cards this long this is nuts what are you serious okay oh well, that's weird though oh my god okay I have to stick with that one because that's it's weird but it's the one Okay, the card that came out is New Moon, which is weird because tomorrow's a full moon, or tonight. A new start is coming. A new start is coming. You know what that's for? The Pluto in Aquarius that's finally going to um, relieve the, the Pluto in Capricorn people, which is myself. So hold on just a second. Let me find where this is. Okay, I'm going to read from the booklet. There is a yes coming your way. This is one of the most auspicious cards in the deck. It's totally positive and suggests something new and exciting is developing. The situation you're asking about is blessed and you are on target to achieve your goals. The message from the universe is that you're starting all over again in some way, be that on a new or better course or just feeling more positive about achieving your desired outcome. If you've been feeling stagnant, this card reminds you that life goes in cycles and you're moving into a new cycle now. This is the time to wipe the slate clean. If the translation, or <laughs> I just made up a word. If the situation you asked about has become toxic, either that will clear up now or something totally new and fresh is on its way. I like that. Attune to the moon. I'll see it when I believe it. So in other words, you got to believe it first. Additional meanings for this card. One, a new start is on its way. Yeah. Two, you will soon start to feel more hopeful about getting what you want. Mm. Three, your belief that your dreams can manifest is working well. And four, forget about the past. That's right. Release it today with the Aries full moon. Release any of the negativity and the hardship and the pain, release that and strain out the lessons and the goodness and the new you and the strengths that you have, that you have right now today with this full moon in Aries. Take the good, take the good from the past, but leave it in the past, leave the rest of it in the past. Okay, the teaching. The new moon marks the start of the waxing cycle and the midpoint of the dark moon. It, it's a dark and uh, veiled time when the moon is visible and a time of rebirth. Invisible. The moon is invisible. I, I don't know. I'm, uh, my moon is Aries and I was on this trip this, this last week um, with my mom and it was very like long and I'm still tired and I haven't recovered fully. So that's the backstory, but let's just finish this last sentence, shall we? It's a dark and veiled time when the moon is invisible and a time of rebirth. It's a time that witches do their work, making wishes and laying down intentions for the new cycle, an intensely magical time when it's easier to pierce the veil to the other worlds. Okay, so it's interesting on this big full moon, we got a new moon card, but I think it's trying to let us know that there's a new time coming. And so it's time to awaken. It's time to rejoice. I wrote that in one of my poems. Um, but first we need to let go of the old and that's what we need to do today. And I wish you luck. I hope that whenever you get this card, that whenever you see this reading, it's meant for you. So maybe it's not on the full moon on Aries, in Aries, 
it's still a relevant message for you. But if you did receive it today, I hope you come to my full moon meditation at 8 p.m. Pacific during my live. Take care.